We're going to show you in this video how to run some simple networking commands that are required before you start using an IP or PoE camera on your network. So these commands are being done on a Mac to teach Mac users how to carry out these commands in case they already don't know how to. The first thing is you go into your taskbar on the bottom, launch the launch pad and type in terminal. So you can launch the terminal. Now here we want to run a few commands. The first one is trace route. We do T-R-A-C-E R-O-U-T-E to 8.8.8.8 .8 and hit enter. We need you to take a screenshot or copy and paste the readout you get from this. The command is completed and send it over to us in an email. So take a screenshot of this. You can open up your launch pad and go to text edit. That's what it's called. And new document. And it takes a little while for this command to complete. You'll have to wait until it completes, like so. You get your command prompt back again here. So you can copy this from the beginning of the command. Right click, copy, go back into here, click paste. Now, the next command we want to do is not through the terminal, but you have to go through into your system settings and go to network. Click on your Wi-Fi, if you're on a MacBook, and if you're on a desktop Mac, you'll have to find your network adapter. And then from there, click on details next to your network connection to find your IP address and your router. We need a screenshot of these two. You could also just try to type it in by typing in like this. So this is the IP address that is assigned to your laptop. And this is the router's IP address. Okay. Now, once you know your IP address here, if you are connected to a Wi-Fi router that also has wired network ports, then your camera that you're purchasing from us is also going to connect to the same router, same network. We need to give it an IP address. An IP address has four octets. The first three numbers are the first octet. The second three numbers are the second octet. And then in the third octet, we just have one number. In the fourth octet, we have a single number as well. So the IP addresses on the same network change only in the last octet. They go from one, which is for your router, up to 254. So in your case, or in or my case, if my IP address or scheme, IP address scheme is 192.168.1, the next number could be dot six. So I'm gonna try that. And you can see if something is on that IP address by typing the ping command. And then that IP address, you want to see if something's on there. And if it comes out, request timed out, meaning there's nothing else that exists on that IP address. But something I know that exists, to show you an example, if something was present, you would get a reply from it that would look something like this, where there would be a time associated with it in milliseconds. You don't want to set your camera to an IP address that is the same as another device on your network. So now we're hunting to see if you have available IP addresses on your network. Certainly I have 1.6 available because it timed out. But I like to set my IP addresses on my cameras to 192.168.1.108. I want to see if that comes out. It says request timed out. That means it's available. There's nothing present on the network to reply back to this command. So the timeout is actually good for me. So I can set my camera to this. So running these three commands uh, helps us know exactly what is your network environment and what IP address to set your camera to. So one was a trace route. It lets me know exactly how many hops you have from your network where your laptop is, which eventually you'll connect your camera to, how many hops are from that local network to the outside internet. I just have one hop, which is my router, and then my outside network. Second was finding the IP address scheme of my network and then finding an available IP address to go along with that. Uh, IP address scheme. Hopefully you found this video useful. Thanks for watching.
If you're watching on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.